Hi YouTube, it's been a while since I've made a fire alarm video, but um, I'm going to do a wheel lock MT test using some different wiring. Um, as you can see, I have my um, some standard bell wire leading from the back of the wheel lock MT. Um, going all the way to some um, alligator clips and two 9 volt batteries and going to the pole station. Um, the reason why I had replaced uh, my other set of wiring, I kind of did a little bit of repair. Um, the reason why I am using standard bell wire is because um, the other wire, like I said, needed some repair. And plus, when I would try and set it off, the alarm would only work for, like, just a second and then quit. I think it had, like, a short in it or something. So, this is going to be a test um, to see how well the standard bell wire works, which is um, this stuff here. As you can tell, it's a lot um, thinner than my other wire that I had connected to the alarm before in my other videos. So... Here we go. Okay. This will be my first way. The pull way. Okay, um, in case you're wondering why I set my camera down, well, I couldn't really hold it to, I couldn't really hold it and reset the pull station at the same time, so that's why I set it down right there. Um, well, anyway, um, I'm going to do another test now using fire drill mode on the Simplex T-Bar. Um, and by the way, there's the back of the Simplex T-Bar in case any of you are new to YouTube. So um, I'm going to do fire drill mode now. <clears throat> Um, there you have it. That and by the way, that and by the way, the horn was in um, continuous horn. By the way, and thank you for watching my video. I, ho I hope you enjoyed it, and please do not forget to rate and comment. Bye bye.